Hi everyone and welcome to my first ever vlog. I am so so excited to start vlogging and hopefully I'm going to vlog today and tomorrow and I'm just so so excited to start vlogging because it seems so fun and this will hopefully go on a vlogging channel which hopefully I'll make up or I'll put it on my main channel and then when I have a vlogging channel move it move it over move it over so i'm so so excited to start vlogging and my arm is already killing me and i've done about 30 seconds so i'm going to switch arms so today i thought i would clear out my room completely i'm not going to redecorate my room but i thought i'd clear out my room completely and kind of start again and get rid of loads of stuff and actually only keep things i really need and only really wear and use Every day, every word that I say, lip service I'm okay, I'll deny what's beneath the surface Without you here, I don't know what I'm doing Can't hide my fears, I try but I'm in ruins I can sit and lie to you But what's the point, what's the use you can see I'm blind for you You break the rules and I'm the fool that wants you badly No matter what you do I still love you madly With your every move What is in this? Right guys, I haven't emptied my room for probably about probably about six years which sounds really disgusting I know but I've just found a bag in this turning unit and I don't know why I have this or what I ever plan to do with it but I've got a bag here full of fluff honestly full of fluff why I don't understand what was, I, what was I planning to do with this? Can anybody give me hints or comment down below why I would have this? But I do. Every day, every word that I say, lip service. Another thing I have just found in my room are two tiny trolleys. I don't understand. Why do I have this stuff in here? I have a pink trolley and a green trolley. I don't understand. They are quite cool, but what am I going to use them for? They go with my room. I don't know what I'm going to use them for though. Hmm. Seriously, do not have a clue. So help me out. So I don't know what to do. Oh. Mary says she's pregnant. She's not. But really, she's faking, and Mr. Schuster doesn't know. Oh my God! Will's busy getting the kids ready. Oh my God! You here? I don't know what I'm doing. Can't hide my fears. I try, but I'm just human. I could sit and lie. I've decided that I don't like my bed where it is so instead of it being where I just put it which is here so instead of it being here like it was I put it here but I don't like it there so I'm gonna turn it completely round so 180 degrees so it goes in that corner redecorating my room was a lot harder than I thought it was and yeah so I'm now going to move my wardrobe from this side of the room to here so it's going to be stood there to that wall there then the chest drawers that are there are going to go there in that corner then the bed's going to go there the computer is probably going to go next to the wardrobe like it is now but here and the spinning unit's going to go there a better day is on the way When Saturday comes, I'll leave ya I know the game, we love 
love to play You walk, I'll follow the leader, leader I'll follow I have moved my wardrobe Whoop whoop Right, by myself I have moved my wardrobe to here Which I kind of like But as soon as you walk into the room I'm gonna focus As soon as you walk into the room It's kind of like BAM Wardrobe But It's quite nice actually I think I might put some photos or something on here To make it look all snazzy and a bit nicer um the first um order that i wanted my room to go in like the first way i wanted it to go in which would not have worked now was i wanted to have the wardrobe here the bed there and a bedside table there but that is a tiny gap and my bedside table is that big so that will fit in there and it'll come to about here the doors will not be able to open so i have decided not to keep the bed there one is complete that was to move my wardrobe to here now task two is to put this spinny um, mirror thing in that corner there so let's get do it let's get do it let's get to it <laughs> i'm okay i'll deny what's beneath the surface without you here i don't know what i'm doing Right, task two has been complete now, and that was to move this into the corner. There you go. So that's that done. And now I think I'm going to move the computer desk to here, in that kind of new corner made. I just think that'd be quite good there. And yeah, I'm quite excited. It looks quite good so far. So, yeah, the hardest things to move will be the chest of drawers because I have not completely emptied them. They are still full of clothes. Bearing in mind, that's my bed there and that has my whole entire wardrobe on it. And then I've got to move my bed there. So, at the moment, it's kind of like Tetris. So, yeah. So, task three is to move this bad boy to here. Well, to there. So, let's get started. I'm in ruins. I can sit and lie to you But what's the point, what's the use You can see I'm blind for you You break the rules and I'm the fool Now, the next thing to do Which is going to be the toughest thing to do Is going to be put everything that's on that chest of drawers or something Somewhere, whether it's here, in the hall Or my mum's room, which I've kind of filled So that's not great everything that's on there so it's enough for me to move it out the way then i've got to rotate this 360 degrees well not 360 180 degrees so it's facing that wall so that's not going to be fun but i've done half of it and i've done the easier part so now here comes the tough challenge of actually doing this so now i'm kind of trapped in a little circle thing here because I have managed to move the chest of drawers over there and move the bed out but now I don't know how to rotate the bed and put it in that corner so I'm gonna have a go at doing it but I don't know whether it will work so what I'm gonna hopefully manage to do is push the foot of the bed towards me as much as possible this way here then hopefully it's enough room for the head of the bed to go around and then I need to push the foot of the bed that way and then keep going until it's in that corner but the moment I'm really liking this setup I kind of like it so hopefully once I move the bed into that position then that's fine and all it is is just putting stuff back so let's get on with it <laughs> basically you me, no matter what you do I still love you madly With your every move I want you so bad
fears I try but I'm just human there's just so much stuff and it's so crazy how much I actually have like I look at people who like are sorting out their wardrobes and do like wardrobe tours and stuff and I'm like but mine's not that big but there's a lot of stuff and I don't really wear that like different things so that's why I need to sort this out throw away stuff and then buy things I actually will wear and actually do need so yeah <sighs> a lot to do so little time to do it.